Alright guys, today we are back for another video and today we're going to be showing you guys how you guys can get way more FPS on Roblox. In fact, 1000 FPS. So yeah, if you guys want to know how to get 1000 FPS on Roblox, then stay tuned guys because... It's not clickbait. We're going to be showing you guys how to do this today, okay? But so yeah, basically, the way you're going to want to do this is at first, I believe this works on most games. This is mainly for FPS games like Arsenal, Phantom Forces, more sorts of games like that. Not just any simulator game, because you don't really need more FPS for a game like that, really. But if you want, you can. Um, but I'll have a picture up on screen and a link in the description to the website where you can download the fps unlocker basically you just need to get an fps unlocker and what this does it does something in your game files where it uncaps your fps and it makes it so you can have basically infinite fps it's kind of weird i know but you can put it on no cap there is some settings on the fps up uh, unlocker um and basically you can literally get however much fps you like there's all different settings uh the only thing is whenever you turn off your PC and turn it back on, you have to relaunch the FPS unlocker. So basically, all you're going to want to do when that happens is go back into your files, go back to the FPS unlocker, double-click double, double click on it again, and bring it back up. So that is how you guys can get way, way, way more FPS on Roblox. And if you guys want to see how much FPS you have, all you've got to do is join a game like Arsenal where they have how much FPS you've got in the top corner of the screen. And trust me, it works because I've been playing a lot of Arsenal recently and it 100% works, guys. Um, But yeah, there's another way to get more FPS on Arsenal and games like that. Basically, you're going to want to go in your files and uninstall textures and stuff. There's all sorts of different stuff that you can do like that. By uninstalling your textures, it basically makes it so you get more FPS and less input delay or lag so yeah if you guys want the most ultimate way of getting fps or no input delay or lag then uh definitely go ahead and uninstall your textures as well there is some videos on youtube to un uninstall your textures um if you guys would like a video on that then do let me know but uh yeah that is how you guys can get yourself infinite fps pretty much well 1000 fps on roblox and i'm pretty sure you guys can do this with almost any pc um because I'm pretty sure you can because um, Roblox doesn't take a lot to run, basically, if you guys know what I mean. It's not like a game like Fortnite that takes a lot to run. Roblox does not take a lot to run, so you guys will be able to get um, so much FPS easily, um, even if you have a lower NPC. Obviously, you won't get as much on a lower NPC, but you'll still be getting so much FPS. But yeah, guys, I'm going to have Thomas more videos out like this for you guys in the future, so make sure you guys do drop a like on the video and subscribe. It'll definitely help me out and help us on our road to 20k subs thank you guys so so much for all the support recently i will be live streaming again soon i've just been taking a couple days off while i've been doing this type of content but i will be doing a live stream within the next few days okay guys but yeah that is pretty much it for today's video hopefully guys did all enjoy today's video and hopefully you can all now get yourself infinite fps on roblox but yeah that's pretty much it for today's video i hope you guys did all enjoy today's video if you did make sure to drop a fat like subscribe and i'll see you all in the next one peace out guys